Among the monsters haunting the desert night, a juvenile delinquent terrorises the microcosmic underworld. The ant lion. It is the nymph phase of the lacewing. The decidedly more elegant adult feeds on pollen, nectar and the odd aphid. But in its larval stage, the ant lion is a menacing carnivore. This natural born killer is armed to the teeth, literally. Its mandibles resemble sickle blades. And it's not afraid to use them. It preys on passers-by, building a trap, one of the most efficient traps in the animal kingdom. The ant lion begins construction by crawling backwards, using its abdomen as a plow, shoveling up the sand, then throws each little pile clear of the scene. He keeps moving round and round to make the pit deeper. About three inches across and two inches deep, until the slope is as steep as it can be without collapsing. A death trap, a masterpiece of devious engineering. Hiding just under the surface, it lies in wait for innocent passers by. Concealed beneath the sand, the lava can sense faint ground vibrations. The spider wanders close. But not close enough. A foraging ant. Moving closer. It stumbles into the hole. The ant lion launches. But this lucky ant finds its footing and escapes a gruesome death. The predator doesn't have to wait long. Another ant tumbles into the trap. And this one can't get out. The sandy wall is unstable by design. The lava now throws sand at the ant to knock it off balance and creates an avalanche that delivers its victim to its waiting jaws. The ant lion injects the ant with venom and enzymes before starting to suck the life out of the still struggling victim. It's as if the earth has opened up and swallowed the ant whole. The ant lion's trap provides a ready-made grave. <laughs>